Hi guys, Bob for Bob's Movie Review here, and today I'm bringing you the Hateful Eight Blu-ray DVD Digital HD Combo Pack, only at Best Buy Steelbook. If you enjoy the video, please leave it a like rating. So these are the new Steelbooks for the Hateful Eight, only available at Best Buy for a limited time. I think it was $25, I pre-ordered mine when they were 30 and I think they came down to 25 the Hateful Eight. When I first saw this, I was like, is this even a steel book? Like, you know, it's just a metal pack or something else. It just didn't, it looks different than any steel book I've ever seen. I, I'm not sure why, but, uh, you can see there on the spine, it is the right packaging. Um, I haven't seen this one, to be honest. I'm probably not going to get a chance to watch this for at least a week. I, I really want to see it, but... With the length and my busy schedule this week, I'm not really going to get a chance to watch it. Brilliant Tim Grierson, Screen International, Epic Peter De Bruges Variety. This text is pretty small. In the Hateful Eight, set six or eight or twelve years after the Civil War, a stagecoach hurdles through the wintry Wyoming landscape. The passengers, bounty hunter John Ruth, and his fugitive Daisy Demarouge. Demer Race toward the town of Red, War Red Rock, where Ruth, where Ruth, known in these parts as the Hangman, <laughs> will bring Demarouche to justice. Along the road, they encounter two strangers: Major Marquise Warren, a black former Union soldier turned infamous bounty hunter, and Chris Mannix, a Southern renegade who claims to be the town's new sheriff. Losing their lead on the blizzard, Ruth. Demarouge, Warren, and Manic seek refuge at Minnie's Haberdashery, a stagecoach stopover on a mountain pass. When they when they arrive at Minnie's, they are greeted not by the proprietor, but by four unfamiliar faces. Bob, who's taking care of Minnie's while she's visiting her mother, is holding holding up with Oswaldo. Mom, Mombre, <laughs> uh, the hangman of Red Rock, <laughs> cow puncher Joe Gage, wait, no, <laughs> Joe Gage, and Confederate General Sanford Smithers. As the storm overtakes the mountainside stopover, our eight travelers come to learn they may not make it to Red Rock after all. That is about the most difficult time I've ever had reading a description. <laughs> It's just, I don't know if it's intentionally funny, but I found it funny. And uh, here's some pictures. Nice Kurt Russell picture there. Uh, special features, Beyond the Eight, a behind the scenes look. Sam Jackson's Guide to Glorious 70mm. This movie is rated R for strong bloody violence, a scene of violent sexual content, language, and some graphic nudity. 168 minute runtime. I thought this was a. Uh, I thought this was supposed to be three hours. 160, 2, 120, and 60 is 180. I thought this was supposed to be three hours. Well, almost. Rated R. I already said that. <laughs> so yeah, like I said, it's gonna it's gonna take me uh, probably till next week before I get a chance to to watch this. Uh, who who picked this up today? Who's seen it? What'd you guys think? Uh, did you guys did anybody pick up the steel book? Really curious uh, how limited they were and such. I really like the artwork. Does anybody know is this the artwork for the book? Because I looked I looked up the Hateful Eight on Walmart and they had a book with this cover, so it's kind of a kind of a cool look to this thing. Oh, I can't get the back off. Too much glue. Oh, jeez. All right, and the back. Pretty cool. I don't know why they gotta use so much glue. Don't they know people wanna see the back? Like, they're wrapped in plastic, so this thing doesn't have to be glued on there. All right, well, let's check out the inside. All right. So, uh, let's see, if you're wondering, this has three holders, there was actually the digital copy was in the holder for some reason. So here we have our DVD, it's silver. 
and our Blu-ray has the same artwork as the back and tons of pictures like a collage style inside I mean, it's cool I would have liked maybe just one good picture not this picture because it's already used twice but just some kind of picture from the movie but it's still a really nice steel book really glad I got it so before you guys ask everybody always asks I get these things on eBay I just look up uh, steelbook protectors and you know I get them and they're they're less than a dollar each uh, when I buy them I think I bought like 50 last time I don't remember it's like $44 or something like that so they're really nice for keeping your steelbooks protected obviously they're not gonna protect it from dents and such but from scratching and stuff like that uh, so I will be giving away the digital copy that was included with this if you'd like to enter that giveaway it's open to US residents only and you must be 18 years of age or older, click on the first link in the description and it'll take you to a website where you can earn super easy entries by following me on my social media accounts. If you haven't already, subscribe for more videos and I'll see you guys next time. If you're interested, be sure to subscribe on YouTube, follow on Facebook, follow on Twitter, and follow on Instagram.